Hi, this is Ryan Thompson, Assistant Athletic Director for Communications at Davenport University. And today I have the privilege of being joined by head men's soccer coach, Chris Hughes. How are you today, Chris? Doing well, doing well. We're still playing, so giddy up, let's do this. That's right. You guys made the trip up to Marquette on Sunday and came through with a, uh, a tie at 1-1, one to -one, but advanced on PKs 4-1. to -one. Uh, Just some thoughts about that contest and how you guys persevered. Well, I'll tell you, the first round is always the most difficult round for sure. You know, trying to find a way to win. And, and you know, we've had some we've had some challenges this year in our program, you know, with some injuries and, and just several things going on. We haven't had a full squad for four or five games. And, and uh, you know, we're, we're attempting to slowly get back some players. So uh, but but I'll tell you, I'm so proud of the boys. You know, they, they battled and, and Northern's got a great squad. You just never know what they're going to bring. They're well coached. And, um, you know, we, we were able to put, put a early goal away on them and, and they were able to tie it up and, you know, kudos to both squads, but, but, uh, it came down to PKs and man, uh, now we advance. So we're excited about, uh, playing Friday. I was digging through some of the archives and the NAIA days is the last time we've had that chance to do PKs in the national tournament. So, you know, at what point are you guys on the sideline saying, wow, we might have to have a lineup here of guys that are going to take these and how much thought process went into that? I'm smarter than I look. Uh, that that was well planned out uh, weeks ago, and uh, you know it, it's uh, PKs. It, it is some people love them, some people hate them. It is what it is, you know. And they've got to figure out who advances. And and this time, luckily, we were on the top side, so uh, it's not easy being on the other side. I've been on the other side also, and and for sure a challenge. But uh, uh, both teams just played their hearts out uh, last weekend. Well, you had to feel pretty confident with Carter Salvius in the net. You know, he had come out for a game to play forward for you guys out of necessity, but he came up huge. He had two stops in PKs. I think he had nine saves overall in the uh, first 110 minutes. So he played a, a remarkable game. Yeah, he, he was just special in the net and, and uh, brings a lot of leadership to the squad. And uh, he can save a couple PKs. So we'll uh, we'll take that one also. <laughs> well, you guys have moved on to the semifinals. You'll take place on Friday at 4 p.m. You guys have Parkside. You'll be playing at Saginaw Valley State. So just kind of go over some of the things with the Parkside uh, matchup coming up, things that you may want to have tweaked from the first matchup. Yeah, you know, first first time we played them, uh, well, let's just give them some kudos for sure to start. They they uh, they found some great consistency over the last four, five, six games, and and they're finding wonderful success. They got a real good squad well coached you know it's not going to be an easy game by any means um, um but i would say looking at the last squad that we had out there was said uh, it was was a, a a bit of a mix you know and 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 so we're hoping to get a couple boys back uh into the squad and and you know at, at that point you get to the semifinals. uh anything can happen you know it's usually the team that makes the the fewest mistakes wins that type of game you know so we need to eliminate the silly mistakes in our last game we made some silly mistakes and i think we've we've tried to correct them uh for sure not perfect but but we've trying to 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 become better on a daily basis become smarter on a daily basis so we're looking forward to that game i know they're looking forward to the game and and uh it'll be all out war on on friday well, good luck on Friday, and hopefully next time we get to chat, you guys will be uh, tournament champs. Oh, boy, that would be awesome. Let's just focus on uh, Friday first, then we'll go from there. Sound good? Yeah, absolutely. One at All a time, right. Coach. Thanks Thank you, for Ryan. joining me. Yeah, appreciate thanks it. for joining me here today. I really appreciate it. And for everything else on the men's soccer program, you can visit dupanthers.com. Follow us on social media by searching DU Athletics.